Hey, I wanted to give everybody a heads up that Snapseed is back for the desktop, kind of. It is now part of the newest Google Chrome browser. So if you are on Google+, Plus, you can upload your files, whether they be TIFF, RAW, JPEG, directly to your Google Plus account, and then edit them in the browser using the Snapseed tools for the desktop. So everything I've showed you, or I'm going to show you here in the desktop version, is applicable to the browser-based version. So what you want to do is just make sure you have the latest version of Chrome and a Google Plus account. If we're here, plus.google.com, pop in there, set yourself up an account. Um, if you want to follow me, just search for uh, Justin Baylog, and um, if you have questions or whatever, I'll get them answered or just post them in the uh, class. If you have any problems, make sure you hit this URL up. There's a couple um, errors here if you're trying to troubleshoot why you can't load the browser or the, the photo editor. Um, you know, you gotta be in the latest version of Mac OS X, update your Chrome, update your graphics dr uh, driver. I didn't have to do any of those, but in case you do, and then if you go into your Google Plus account, just load a photo. Actually, let's go back here. So if we grab a photo like this, we're going to edit it. I'm going to go ahead and revert back to the original image. Here we are with our familiar Snapseed interface. Got the Golden Gate Bridge going on. So we're just going to go ahead and tune that image. See how it just works just like just like normal. Can bring up that the shadows there in the tune image. Apply it. Go ahead and hit the black and white. Bump that contrast up a little bit. Maybe a little bit of brightness. Go ahead and apply it. Hit the structure slider or structure module. Bring out some or the details module. Bring out some structure in the in the clouds. There we go ahead and apply it. You know, back to the fabled center focus that we love so much. You know, everything's just the same as it is in the desktop, but now it is all in the browser and all your files are being stored on the cloud or in the cloud. Pretty cool stuff, I'd say. Can bring that down, bring the center focus up a little bit, bring the center brightness. Maybe a little much. There we go. Apply that. Comparisons, just like just like we had going on in um, the mobile version, the desktop version, the Android version. It's all there, pretty slick. So we're going to go ahead and click Done Editing. And the cool thing is you can go up to that, um, go back into the edit, and then if you want to revert, you can revert to the image, the original. They apparently save some sort of variation or some sort of copy of the original, so you can do... Um, adjustments tell your heart's content and if you don't like it just revert it pretty slick so I wanted to give you a heads up on that and um, let you know that our favorite desktop editor Snapseed is now in the Google Chrome browser pretty slick so just an FYI and an update to the course and we'll see you out there